Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a significant development for Russia's military capabilities, the Ministry of Defense has announced the induction of 23T-90M Prorev main battle tanks into service with the motorized rifle formation of the Combined Arms Army of the Central Military District, CMD. This enhancement underscores the ongoing modernization efforts within the Russian armed forces, aimed at bolstering the operational readiness and combat effectiveness of its military districts. Established on October 21, 2010, the Central Military District is a pivotal component of Russia's military framework. Formed as part of a comprehensive restructuring formalized by Presidential Decree No. 1144, the CMD amalgamated the Volgural Military District and the western portion of the Siberian Military District. This restructuring aimed to streamline command structures and enhance the strategic responsiveness of the Russian military. Covering an expansive 7,060,000 square kilometers, approximately 2,730,000 square miles, the CMD is the largest military district in Russia by geographic size, encompassing around 40% of the nation's territory. It also holds the title of the most populous military district, home to 54.9 million people, or 39% of Russia's population. The district includes 29 of Russia's 85 federal subjects, such as Altai Krai, Bashkortostan, Chelyabinsk Oblast, and Tatarstan, with its headquarters situated in Ekaterinburg. Since February 17, 2023, Lieutenant General Andrei Mordvichev has commanded the district, overseeing its extensive array of military assets and personnel. The CMD comprises substantial ground forces, including key units like the 2nd Guards Combined Arms Army and the 41st Combined Arms Army, which are equipped with a variety of advanced military hardware. Recent additions to the CMD's arsenal include the T-90M Prorev tanks and BMPT Terminator tank support combat vehicles, enhancing both firepower and operational versatility. The 41st Combined Arms Army has recently deployed T-72BM and T-72B1 main battle tanks near the Ukrainian border, reflecting the district's strategic importance. Furthermore, the CMD's 90th Guards Tank Division, now equipped with the latest T-90M Prorev tanks, represents a significant leap in armored warfare capabilities. The district's 201st military base in Tajikistan has also seen upgrades with T-72B3M tanks and other modern equipment, ensuring readiness in diverse operational environments. The T-90M Prorev-3 is the most advanced iteration of the T-90 series, incorporating several key improvements. It features a 125mm 2A46M, for smoothbore main gun capable of firing both conventional munitions and the 9M119 reflex anti-tank guided missiles, with a range of up to 5 km. The tank's modern automated digital fire control system significantly enhances target acquisition, tracking, and engagement capabilities. Protection is a central focus of the T-90M. The tank employs the Relict Explosive Reactive Armor, ERA, which offers superior defense against modern anti-tank weapons compared to the older Contact, 5 ERA used in previous T-90 variants. Additionally, the tank includes an active protection system that can automatically deploy smoke grenades triggered by laser targeting, obscuring the tank from enemy fire and increasing its battlefield survivability. This combination of reactive and active protection systems makes the T-90M resilient against a wide range of threats, including armor-piercing fin-stabilized discarding SABO, APFSDS, rounds. Despite its advanced features, the T-90M's performance in combat has shown mixed results. Its deployment in the Ukraine conflict has highlighted some vulnerabilities, with numerous tanks being destroyed or captured by Ukrainian forces. Western-supplied systems such as the FGM-148 Javelin Anti-Tank Guided Missile, ATGM, and M142 HIMARS rocket launcher have proven effective against the T-90M. Notably, AT-90M was neutralized by a Bradley M2A2 Infantry Fighting Vehicle, IFV, in Ukraine, underscoring the challenges faced in modern combat environments. The induction of the T-90M Prorev tanks into the Central Military District represents a significant step in Russia's ongoing military modernization efforts. While the T-90M enhances the combat capabilities of the CMD, its mixed performance in Ukraine highlights the evolving nature of armored warfare and the constant need for adaptation and improvement in military technology. As Russia continues to upgrade its military assets, the CMD remains a critical component of its strategic defense infrastructure, prepared to meet the challenges of contemporary and future conflicts. That's all for now, see you later.